Today on OsoGrandeKnives.com we are looking at the new 2013 Jat Singh Khalsa Folding Knife. This is a 1200 piece limited edition sprint run and it is one of the most unique and rare Spider Co production folders that's ever been made. It combines the intricate artistry and the traditional designs of Jat Singh Khalsa. It has G10 medium textured scales on it, stainless steel frame that has been machined so that it's lighter weight on the inside. There's lightning holes drilled in there. I don't know if you can see that or not. It's got post construction so it's an open build, easy to see the workings and keep your knife clean. Lockup is via a Michael Walker liner lock. Opening is via the Spyderco round hole. Now you can move forward on the blade like so for more detailed delicate work. You could also utilize it like that as well. It's got a very pronounced hump on it for the Spyderco hole. The most pronounced of any, any of them that I recall ever seeing. There's a swedge ground tip on this spear point blade. The blade is made of VG10 stainless steel. It has a fluted lanyard hole on the butt end. The pocket clip is mounted on the forward end for tip up right hand carry, but it is also reversible for right or left hand use, so it is completely ambidextrous. All the hardware are Torx head fasteners, so it's very easy to maintain and adjust in the field. Opening is very smooth. Forward or reverse grip. You have a nice rounded butt to rest your thumb on. The overall length is 7.05 inches. It has a 2.91 inch blade with a 2.45 inch cutting edge and a thickness of 0.12 of an inch. Again, the blade steel is VG10 stainless. It's a spear point blade with a flat saber ground edge. The handle length is 4.13 inches and the thickness on the handle is 0.42 of an inch. Again, the handle material is G10. It weighs in at 3.6 ounces. It's a manual opener and it's made in Japan. Again, these are a sprint run. If you want one of the rarest Spyderco knives ever produced, you can purchase these on OsoGrandeKnives.com. Buy it now. And please subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more knife reviews.